Greetings, everybody. I'm here to bring our pastor's update for the week. And as we do, I hope this finds you staying safe and staying well, as we all have to stay home. I got to just start with saying thank you for being the church. Through your prayers, through your encouragement, and through your strong giving, this is incredible how you are still being the church. And through your giving, you make things like this possible, that we can keep doing these things and offering this. So I'm just saying thank you for being the church. And as we look at this week, it's Holy Week. Last weekend was Palm Sunday. Thank you, church, for sending all of your pictures. You were pretty creative on a lot of those, and I say thank you. This week, as we journey through Holy Week, we've come to Thursday, and when we get to Thursday, we're gonna understand, and I'm gonna share a devotion on the meaning of what we call Holy Thursday, Monday Thursday, where they shared the Last Supper with Jesus. And as we share that on Thursday, the significance then takes us to Friday, where Christ died on the cross for our sins. And we will have a service available all day Friday as well for that. Both of these will be on our website. And as I look forward, to this Sunday, Easter Sunday. We're planning something really special. And for you to stay connected with each other and with us, I want you to do, and here's some homework. I want you to take the words, Jesus is alive. And as you take those words, spell those things, use something, be creative to spell out Jesus is alive, take your picture. And for those in the traditional services, send it to this email. And for those in the contemporary service and awaken, have your picture, Jesus is alive, all ready to go for Sunday morning where you can send it to us live. We look forward to both of those things happening and we look forward to celebrating the resurrection of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, who is the hope of the world. He is our hope, especially in these times and our hope for salvation in eternity. So thanks be to our God. God bless you guys.